Hi everyone, I am so excited about this next video. I had the opportunity to go into the voice clinic at ENT Specialist here in Salt Lake City, Utah, and have a flex stroboscopy to show you all what the vocal cords and the vocal tract look like when doing an enforced yell, or what I call concert speech. The reason I wanted to show this is because a lot of singers, actors, and voice users yell a lot during a show or presentation, and this can lead to having a vocal injury. Sometimes an injury can happen not because of the way someone is singing, but from speaking to the audience. These videos will show you what the vocal tract looks like before I straw, after I straw, and after using the combo of both voice straw and voice cup. Okay, this first clip is of the standard example you would hear in a concert. I am purposely adding some growl to it, and I am projecting with a little bit of tension so you can see how the vocal tract squeezes in. I have put a red box around the area I want you to pay close attention to. As we move through these videos, see if you can see a visual difference from video to video. Hey y'all, are you ready for a good time? Let's get ready to rock! Now this next clip is showing what the vocal tract looks like while using the straw and repeating the same phrase with the same intensity. Remember when we train with the straw, what we are positioning is happening in the larynx and on the vocal cord level. Our target with the straw is not vowels and consonants. Our target is the epilaryngeal tube position of the vocal folds and the pharynx, which I will outline in the red box. This should remain relatively constant. We are training our muscle memory to get our vocal tract in its optimum position for better success. We are going for the constant inertance or energy, and then we change everything above the glottis to benefit it even more by adding the voice cups. Again, watch the red box and see if you can notice the difference from the video before. Now watch this next video and see if you can see a difference in the vocal tract configuration from just using the straw. See if you notice if the vocal tract is more stable and has a more open look. Hey y'all! You here for a good time? Let's get ready to rock! Obviously, you cannot talk and sing when you have a straw in the mouth. As mentioned earlier, the straw is not training vowels and consonants. That happens in the upper part of the pharynx. Many people out there wonder why. Why use the straw and how can they keep that same feeling when you take the straw away? Why use the straw when you have to change the vocal tract when you add vowels and consonants? This is where the voice cups come in. When you add the cup, you are able to use the vowels and articulate, but you are still creating the aerodynamic changes on the vocal folds, and with the straw still in the cup, we are helping the acoustical pressures. You are now able to articulate and sing while keeping the vocal tube at its peak performance. This is optimal training for singing, high energy speech, yelling, and screaming. So let's see what happens when we add the cup and change the shape of the vocal tract when we add the speech. Did you notice how the vocal tract was still able to keep its more open configuration while voicing? This is why having the straw and cup combo kit is the game changer for all types of voicing. Now let's watch the final video to see if the vocal tract can remain at its peak level of performance. Notice how there is less compression in the vocal tract from the first video. This is the science behind why the straw and cup combination work. The reviews we are getting from people about what a difference this training kit is absolutely amazing. This should be a must have for any voice user. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out the other videos by subscribing to our channel and checking out our website at www.voicestraw.com. All the links will be posted in the comments. However, these videos could not have happened without the help and generosity from Karen Cox and Jordan LeBaron with the Voice Clinic at ENT Specialists. Thank you guys, I appreciate you more than you will ever know.